बिसमीम् अल्लाम आई होप यू ऑल विल बी फाइन टुडे इन दिस वीडियो आई विल टेल यू अबाउट लिविंग थिंग्स करेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ लिविंग थिंग्स क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ लिविंग थिंग्स बायोडाइवर्सिटी फंक्शंस ऑफ डिफरेंट ऑर्गन्स एंड सिस्टम्स ऑफ लिविंग थिंग्स वॉच माय कंप्लीट वीडियो लेट्स स्टार्ट द वीडियो Our earth is a beautiful place to live. There are different types of trees, plants, birds and animals. They are all living things. You and I are human beings. We are also living things. Everything around us can be grouped into living things and non-living things. A living thing is anything that is alive now or was once alive. All living things follow a life cycle which is a series of changes that living things experience over a period of time. The life cycle is introduction means birth growth and development fully grown means maturity and death now first we will talk about characteristics of living things growth food nutrition requirement respiration movement reproduction excretion sensitivity to surroundings these are some characteristics of living things now we will talk about classification of living things grouping things according to their similarities and differences is called classification There are two types of animals vertebrates and invertebrates Vertebrates have a backbone and a skeleton made of bones inside their body They are further divided into different groups mammals fish amphibians reptiles and birds The brain of a vertebrate is enclosed in a skull. Invertebrates form a large group of animals that do not have a backbone or an internal skeleton. Insects, worms and spiders are all examples of invertebrates. Some invertebrates like worms and jellyfish have soft bodies. Others like crabs, spiders and insects have a hard outer casing covering their soft body. Now we will talk about classification of plants. Plants can be classified into flowering and non-flowering plants. The bright colorful flowers that you see on trees and plants help them to reproduce. All flowering plants produce flowers which later turn into fruits with seeds inside them. Not all plants bear flowers. Conifers produce seeds in cones which are hard protective coverings around the seeds. Ferns and mosses produce spores. Now we will talk about biodiversity. Biodiversity is the variety of plants 
animals and microorganisms found on earth we depend on this variety for different reasons certain activities like cutting down trees destroy the homes of animals cause many plants and animals to decrease in numbers some plants and animals even disappear from earth some of the activities that harm planet earth are cutting down trees for wood to build cities houses etc polluting air and water by releasing smoke chemicals and other harmful substances into them not disposing of waste water and garbage from our homes and industries properly all these harmful activities affect our own health and the health of other living organisms as well as the environment now functions of different organs and systems of living things the human body is made up of internal organs body parts bones muscles and systems the brain is a part of the nervous system and is the main control center of the human body the human skeleton is made up of many bones bones are hard on the outside and soft on the inside bones give the body shape and support muscles form the muscular system without muscles we would not be able to move muscles are attached to bones and always work in pairs they work by contracting and relaxing the heart along with the blood and blood vessels form the circulatory system all living things need oxygen to survive when we breathe oxygen reaches our lungs a pair of lungs is in the chest on either side of the heart our teeth help us to bite and chew the food and break it up into small pieces before it goes through our digestive system the stomach is like a muscular bag it is important for digesting food the food that enters the stomach from the food pipe is mashed and mixed with juices now we will talk about some important parts of a plant roots the stem the leaves flowers and fruits are some important parts of a plant the stem is the main support of the plant flowers help plants reproduce seeds are found inside fruits under the right conditions they grow into new plants this was all about living things kindly share my video and subscribe my channel for more videos thank you allah hafiz